chem tools. Today we're looking at the R70 Deox range of uh, cleaners and this one's the R70. Now R70 is a chemically engineered multifunctional formulation that provides unprecedented penetration, lubrication, unsurpassed corrosion protection to multi-metals. R70 has been specifically formulated for the electrical, telecommunications and electronics industry which require unique solutions. Now with our cans they have some nice features. They have the AccuJet top, which sprays out like that. Or sprays out like that. What we're gonna to do today, we have a mobile phone, which is a Blackberry in working condition. I'm charging it currently. I'm gonna pull the charger out, pop the battery out. Now the nice thing about the R70 is that it will protect the metals in the terminals. So I'm going to spray a little bit on the battery terminals. I'm going to spray a little bit into the charging port. Now I'm going to protect the battery as well and spray some on the battery terminals. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to clip the battery back in. Put the back back on. Now the nice thing about R70 is it doesn't affect the properties of the electronics. If it's an insulator, it will continue to be an insulator. If it's conductive, it will continue to be conductive. It also protects the bare metal. And what it's going to do with our phone is it's going to uh, let it be dropped into a bucket of water with the charger in, which incidentally is at 12 volts through a plug pack. I really don't recommend doing this with anything directly connected to the mains, but this is a plug pack, so it's electrically isolated. I'm plugging my charger back in and it's still switched on charging and what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to dunk the Blackberry into the water while it's switched on. And as you can see there now, the phone is still on. I'll bring it out of the water. And it's still powering up obviously, but there's no effect on the Blackberry. It's still powering up quite nicely. And just to prove it's working, I'll slide the phone shut again and I'm going to dunk it in again. And we'll just watch it power up a little bit underwater. phone's almost rebooted. The nice thing about smart phones is they do take a couple of minutes to reboot. Okay, it's picked up the network and it's under, under a foot of water and the phone's still going. Look at that.